What's going on guys? As you can see right here, this is the Holy Stone HS210. This is the drone that we're going to be reviewing today. It's all packaged and in the box right now. So we're going to take a look at this drone and we're going to review it today and we're going to see if it's any good or not. So anyways, let's get right into the video. Alright guys, this is everything that we have right here. We have the drone with a battery in it, as you can see right there. Two extra batteries, so that gives us a total of three batteries, the controller, the instruction book, and a screwdriver. As you can see, first glances with the drone, it is um, pretty cool looking. I, I like the way it looks. Um, around the propellers you have these plastic rings so that would protect it if it hit the wall or something it wouldn't damage the propeller so you'd be just fine with that so that's really good first glance with this drone here's the controller right here the sticks very movable it's pretty small the controller in my hands like it's pretty hard to grip onto it but remember this is a little toy to fly around at your house so I'm not complaining too much it looks pretty good uh, with the first glance oh and guys one more thing that I completely forgot to include they also give you one of these this is a lipo charger so you just pop this off that's a little USB plug that you would plug into your computer and then on this side you plug your little batteries in there so that's cool that they decide to include this with the drone sometimes when you order drones from these random companies off of AliExpress or Amazon uh, you, you can't really trust them that much they're coming from China and it, they're really suspicious but you know when you get a brand like Holy Stone typically it's going to fly very well it's gonna be m pretty reliable for you so that is one thing that I am actually pretty excited about for this um, I guess there's nothing further. I'm going to give you specs for this drone. I'm going to put them up on the screen for you. And then we're going to get right into the flight test because I actually am very excited to take this guy up in the air. Anyways, let's go. All right, guys. So before we take this drone out for a little flight test, I just want to give you a quick startup guide so you can get uh, flying and so you know what to do it's very very simple so first of all you have the battery in the bottom of your drone and you have that little connector right there so you're just gonna plug that in to start off I'm gonna set my microphone down and it is plugged in and ready to go the drone is ready the controller you turn it on, you can hear those beeps, go up, down, and then once the lights are solid, it's ready to go. Now, to arm the motors, you hit that button right there, and I'm going to take it off and we're going to see how loud it is. I'm going to put the microphone right over here, and then let's start. Let's bring it back closer to us. So we hope you can get an idea about how loud it is with that little test. Whoa, look how smooth that is. Side to side. It's so quiet too. That does have a drift. It is drifting. Let's move it forward. Let's see it has those propeller guards. Let's see what happens if you crash it. Oh, head propeller guards, so it just bounces off. See? Just bounces right off. I'm 
sometimes life's a mess I get high when I'm upset I remember when me and love did click Searching for something real, then I found it Okay, so just so you know, I've reviewed several micro drones lately on this channel, and I'm going to be honest, this has got to be my favorite one so far. I've liked all of them, and I've named off all of the reasons why I like them, and I'll leave those videos linked for you in the description below, so go check those out. But this one has got to be my favorite because of how really durable this is and easy it is to fly. Not only does it have these rings built around the propellers, um... It also is extremely easy to fly for a beginner. So once you turn both the drone and the controller on, there's a basic button to take it off and land it. Your speed control is up there, and the controller is, you know, easy to operate. And it just flies really well. And since it is from Holy Stone, it does feel like it is a better quality drone for it being so micro. All right, so yes, I would recommend picking up this drone, especially if you're going to get it as a Christmas present because that holiday is coming up here soon. So stay tuned to my channel for other videos on more drones like this, RC planes, and more. So I'd like to thank you if you're still here for watching. Please like this video. It helps support my channel and consider subscribing. And hopefully I'll see you in my next video. Have a great day.